The purpose of YAA is to help other teens going through treatment, helping making that journey better for them. One of the biggest fears of having um, cancer or anything like it is going in for your next scans and making sure that everything's still okay. Like when you come out of treatment, you there's like a, there's a, you might feel that you're sort of isolated because it's like uh, I think definitely some people like they lose friends going through all of this just because they don't get to see them as often. Sometimes it's difficult because your friends they pity you. We don't want pity. We don't want pity. Are they, 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 they trying to relate it to something yeah. they went through, which is nothing alike? Yeah. yeah. Like, like when people said you're so strong, I was like, well. I mean, I don't have a choice. I didn't have a choice. It's like, yeah. I wasn't brave, you know? Yeah. It's like, I had to do this to live. I wanted to live. I'll have your empathy, but I'm not going to have you again. Like, your tears. Like, I don't want you to cry for me. Like, you have your own life. This sort of community has definitely helped me not feel as isolated or as alone as I think some people sometimes are. It's helpful for us because we're coming together. And when we talk about it, we also process it and we help each other go through that process. And it's very therapeutic. It's all about giving back and sort of helping those in the future and those who are currently going through treatment. And it's beautiful. Yeah. It's literally gorgeous. Everywhere you go, there's something that you can look forward to.